Uh, and then you got other people that are like still like who didn't win the last bracket or didn't come close to top two, like Sleepy, for example. Yeah, Sleepy, Skull, and um, Soulful. Yeah. Them three. So many good players. And even like uh, Dare Bear, she's like still in bracket. Oh, yeah. And like Ness is a problem, man. I don't, I don't think people want to acknowledge that. Ness is like legitimately a problem in DFW. Yeah, Ness is uh, it's something else. Like, if you play against a Ness player, like, it's hard to. It's hard to decide like if you're gonna win or not because their their percentage, high percentage, high kill power is so dumb. Oh, it's but so, it's so stupid. It's just how it is. I prefer that because I like Austin as a player. He deserve it. Suffering so with Ness for over four Smash iteration, especially in Smash Four, how you keep constantly lose against Light. I felt so bad just because Light was playing Corrin and like hitting it with Rosalina every once in a while. I'm like, damn, dude, like this is tough. Yeah, dude. Like, I felt bad for for Austin. Like, he couldn't do anything about Corn. I forgot about the Corn matchup. Like, as soon as he was off stage, he just he just died. Yeah, he just died. Down B and yeah, um, dry. Well, the the lance from side B. Side B for Corn is dumb too. It's super safe on against Ness. Oh man, it's it was free. So dumb. It's free on Ness. If you play Corn, you get a free win against Ness. No matter how bad you play, just side B and down B, and you win. Yeah, she just outranged him, and then she just killed him when he was all. If he's never in disadvantage, yeah, it was I, so tough for Ness in that game. Yeah, I had to talk to Austin like, "Hey, man, just just don't play Smash Four because as long as Light is there with Corrin, you can't go any further than that." Yeah, yeah. but which I'm kind of glad that Ness is had is really good in this game because he deserved it. He had he had so many bad matchups during, all all over the years of Smash, like Smash 64. He's pretty bad off stage melee. Um, Better characters, brawl, chain grab for death, Smash Four, Corrin, Rosa is just terrible. Uh, well, he did his work, and we're about to see if uh, Highwayman can do his work. Uh, Freaks Highwayman, by the way. Highwayman versus Bolt. Oh, that was a good confirm. Wow, that actually confirmed. Uh, what was that like? Um, the neutral B into a uh, up smash. That's crazy. Yeah, dude. Ooh, Bolt, covering option. If only if he only he has a good timing for it. Oh, that was nice. Yeah, he went for the counter there to stop the uh, Matui, I think it's called. Yeah. Well, Bolt play style, Piranha play is very interesting. I don't see that type of play style a lot. Oh, he has them all stage. You could possibly just kill him here if he gets the right read. Yeah. You know, Ooh. out of all the ledge trappers in the W, I give Highwayman the most credit. He's so good at ledge trapping. Yeah, I don't know. That's scary. His down B to Highwayman, he could just neutral B him. I don't know. Like he should be careful with that. Ooh. Okay, it's so scary versus Lucario at this percentages. Ooh. Because you could definitely just get side beat and just die. Yeah. Ooh. Oh, he's just. Oh my God, that has fast. What was That's it. S smash. Oh my God, that was it. Yeah, that was it. His counter is so terrible. You could just, like, see it and then just punish. I keep telling Howie Man not to use that counter so much because, like, counters, like, his singles are kind of, like, kind of trash. I'm not going to lie to yeah, you. Yeah, counter is trash unless you're playing Joker. Yeah, unless Joker. Like, Joker has, like, a really good counter, like, bayonet every once in a while. But, Joker like, counter is, like, a big square. Like, a giant square. He could punish you, like, even if you space it well. Everyone else's counter, if you space it well, you don't get punished. Oh, side B. Oh, command grab. Disappear. Ooh. That's so... <laughs> That's so badass. I'm not going to lie. That side B animation for a kill is so clean. It's so sick. He's just like, he's like, it's like that, that one anime, like, going on my shin Boom. It's like that type of thing. It's like the Bruce Lee one-inch punch, man. Yeah, it's dude. Like so sick, dude. Oh, yeah, man. Or that shatter point from Mace Windu. He's just like, boom. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh, my God. It's so sick. Yeah. All right. He's got to lead, though. He's got so much aura on his side, too. Let's not forget Lucario is, like, ridiculous with this amount of aura. No, Loki, I think Lucario is a black character. A black character? <laughs> yeah. You think it's a Piccolo or Smash or what? I'm just kidding, dude. I mean, you want to be wrong. That's all I'm going to say. Yeah. All right, he's looking to get some combos here. It seemed like, man, it seemed like he had, so, he had a great lead, and then, like, Highwayman's lead just kind of went away. Yeah, oh. I think Piranha Pie does a good job how Lucario is approaching. Because, like, Lucario's... It's really good with his aerials when when he has like high percentage because of aura, but Piranha does a good job like anti-airing. Like Piranha is like one of those characters that just really has a lot of tools to anti-air. Yeah, and that was a really good tech. I wouldn't have teched that. I wouldn't be quiet. Oh, oh, oh man! I was hoping for the animation. I was hoping for the animation too. What happened there, man? <laughs> did we did we lose the budget midway through? What happened? Yeah. 
Ooh. I am liking these beer reverse. Uh, yeah, the beer reverse, I think, is the answer of approaching Piranha Plant. At 20%. Yeah. And he keeps getting more and more rage as this time goes on. Or more and more aura, I should say. More and more aura and rage. Aura rage is scary for Lucario. <laughs> oh, Empty Hop. I don't, I don't know why he went for Empty Hop. There's nothing, like, beneficial for that. Any of his aerial moves. It's very questionable. Like, Piranha Plant is really good grounded as a character grounded. You say really good grounding, my man. Get finally got that back here to end that stock. True. He shouldn't be close to any. He shouldn't be close to death at any at this point, but you, you never know. It's still Lucario. Yeah. Oh, back here. Yeah, uh, if he had aura, he would die. Yeah, Prana had his frame data is really good grounded because his tails has iframes and yeah, most of his move has iframes. Really? Yeah. Um, his F tail has iframes for like the first three hits, first frame three or something like that. His jab is, his little leaf jab is like like iframes with it. Oh, that's crazy. I yeah. didn't know that. Yeah, that's why I prefer, when I see Piranha Play, I think grounded Piranha Play is so much better. Like, when it comes to, like, little hits in the ground, mm -hmm. he has iframes on most of his grounded moves. That's actually not too bad, actually. And, of course, using the, um, I think that's the down B, I want to say it is. Ooh, he oh. finally got the hit. Finally got that counter after, like, 32 tries. Yeah, that that, that kind of sucks. <laughs> yeah, kinda if sucks. It, it, it was like, it was like um, Ike or Roy, that would kill. Oh, yeah, Ike's just got, like, man, Ike's lasts forever, too, by the way. Oh, yeah. Oh, there you go. Oh, command grab? Oh, oh yeah. I thought he was going to live that. Got the Goku special coming out from, uh, of course, the Goku voice character, Lucario. Oh, yeah. Iron Man will be taking game one. Oh, yeah. Actually, that was a pretty long game one. Not going to lie. I thought it would be game three already, or game two. But, yeah. It's kind of weird seeing those players kind of, like, you know, I don't know. I feel like once you get to, like, a certain level, like, Games can either go by like super quick or they go by a long versus like really long talented opponents. Maybe yeah. this is the long talented opponents of being in bol uh, Bolt because apparently he's been doing extremely well with this character. Yeah, uh, Piranha Plant. I mean, yeah, that's why I hate playing against on Jamma. We're both really good and like very patient in neutrals. Some, one of, some of us, me and him, we don't even hit each other for the next 30 seconds. <laughs> we just like whiff, throw, throw moves and we not, not interact at all. It's really annoying, but like that's how it is with some characters. That's, that's how it be sometimes. Yeah. Lucario Ooh. is, uh, or not Lucario, Highway Man is just playing a really, just like, really good neutral. Oh, yeah, dude. And he's getting his punches whenever he gets them and, like, always following with the forward air. He's really doing a really good job of just kind of smothering a um, bolt right now. Discount Ivy Nair. I see that. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, some of these characters have the same moves like other characters, but they're like discount versions as the DLC characters. They're like the budget work version. Yeah. yeah. Like, I guess Nintendo does a good job noticing that. They're like, all right, let's give him this move, but this move is really good for this character, and it's pretty broken. Let's just nerf it a little more or it's give not, it, like, a discount hitbox. It's not quite Iron Man, but it's like Tin Man. Or yeah. Like <laughs> oh, shit. That was, that was another counter hit. Oh, I thought he was about the Tom Hawk command grab. I would have died. Ooh, I don't know about the neutral bees. Like, Lucario has a good way to go around that. He really does. He's charging up a lot of oh, that ore spell is looking pretty big right now. Oh yeah, that, that, like a that father was a good and jump. son. I don't know about neutral bees, man. As long as the car has a good up B to go around anywhere, like I don't think that's happening. But neutral B on off stage for recovering is really good. It's pretty darn good. Okay, Ooh. gets the back air finally to get that stock. He was doing a lot of B reverses and everything there, so it's kind of tricky to know what he was intentionally going for. Ooh. Oh, I don't, I don't know if he wanted to go that. I don't. I feel like he's he keeps going for these like these neutral bees or the uh, patuies off of instinct, and I feel like he could get much bigger punish if he just like reacted. That's uh, that's honestly true. I, I feel like he's going his own play style without realizing what he should be using. Like he's going for neutral bees, and it's not connecting. Like all his neutral bees, not not getting the hits that he wants it on it. That's kind of deal. Yeah. Like I mean, like. Granted, like, I play Snake every once in a while, but, like, you have to react to some of his stuff. Like, you just can't be, like, you know, oh, you can't you be doing all the, like, weird stuff. But, like, uh, speaking of weird stuff, the up smash or the up smash, up throw killing, of course. Yeah. That's just one thing I know about mid-tier or low-tier players. They like to go for their own style of play, and they always go for it so many times without realizing it won't work for, with other certain players that are smart about it. Yeah. Yeah. The the method is like to kind of get the idea of like oh, what kind smart. of setups you have, but don't like rely on them like 100% of the time. Yeah, that won't take you far at tournaments, trust me. Or at least come up with options to like, is one of the best things. Like, you know, yeah. okay, this didn't work, okay, I frame trapped them into something else. Yeah, no character will do that to you in Ultimate, unless you're playing Smash 4. 
Oh, <laughs> uh, that's true. <laughs> if you play Smash 4, go for up to us, Ryu. You win. <laughs> <laughs> if you're playing Smash 4 as Bale, just go up B out of shield. No or comment. Just, or side B out of shield. Or side B. You win. No comment. No comment. If no you're comment. playing Cloud at Smash 4, just ca camp limit. You win. Just do Nair. <laughs> yeah, do Nair. You win. Oh, oh my god. Oh, that's animation. That's uh, so sexy. That's so awesome. Yeah. And now Highway Man's up a good stock away from right now. Brown and Black can still kill him, though, of course. Brown and Black, yeah. Oh, oh was, okay. Or he can kill himself, the homie. It's still even, though. Um, what three stock? Doesn't he get, like, a little bit of advantage Lucario does? Or am I tripping about that? No. Uh, yes, he does, actually. Uh, if, if Lucario's having, yeah, Lucario having higher percent and losing his, his stock for um, the other opponent, he get less aura. But okay. it doesn't matter because Highway Man is just playing really good neutral. Yeah, Highway Man is playing a really, really good neutral. Yeah, this he's, he's taking his advantage more further than Bolt is in general. This is one of the main criticisms that I had against some Lucario players. Mm -hmm. like, I feel like they played really good when they were like at that percentage to start doing the rage, uh, rage nonsense. Yeah. Highway Man is just playing a really solid neutral to the point where like if it gets to the rage nonsense, like you're fortunate that you're still living already. Yeah. I think Highway Man does a better job keeping Bolt in the disadvantage more than Bolt is giving him. Oh, that was smart. Oh, that was really good. Oh! He, didn't, he missed tech. Great awareness for Highway Man. Yeah. I don't think Highway Man's got oh. full command man on blast, too. Yeah. And forward smash going into the stock. Highway Man takes it a swift, not a swift, but a long 2 0, actually. Yeah, he, he rolled four times. Uh, it was bound to happen for yeah. a good punish out of that. Um, yeah, if I want to. Given advice for Bo, I think he should be more focusing taking his advantage states much further than relying All on right, neutral B. Because you see this man do neutral B off stage and then it never connected. Not even once. I've never seen one call that he got it. It was in random, uh, uh, random like circumstances.